This could be ridiculous. Oh, Kira. Fire a Q. He got it. He got it. But there's the twisted advance to come through. Domonko is getting burnt down by that ignite, but flashes away nicely. Joska. Oh, my gosh. I would have expected someone to die, but everyone on hard random, they do make it out alive. Yeah. Potentially here. They do have a ward. There's a flash twisted advance now. Nice howling gale, but Yang, he's getting burnt down. Will have to get out. Glitter Lance doesn't quite find the mark. As Symphony's going to flash. Yang doesn't have anything. The passive going to do some work, but first blood goes to Damonko and Joxta now in trouble as well. Kira comes over. Nice flash away from the Mystic Shot as Lex is coming in. The heal from Macau as he heads down here as well. And it's a party around this blue buff yes. spot. Continuing with a bit of a CS advantage. Wow. Rocket jump very aggressively onto Lex here as he gets polymorphed on the bottom side. Jump is not going to work out, Teleport. but that explosive shot doing some work. Smurf wants to come in, does have the soul shackles. Jockster flashes away, but takes the damage. Super Mega Death Rocket nets them the kill, and that Dark Binding not going to quite find uh, Lex there on the bottom side. Macau, I apologize. Tanking it up for so incredibly long. Explosive cast coming through there just for some damage as it's down to about a thousand health. Lex now is looking at that Howling Gale, but it is going to be a Revolta securing away the dragon. Gank in the mid lane. Yeah, Revolta underground. Looking for a knock up there as Dark Binding lands. Revolta, you are so dead, and Kira easily picks up that kill. And yeah, even pushing in the bottom lane. Whoa, oh, Kira's in trouble. He is. Arcane Shift is going to get him to relative safety, but these ults are doing so much work. Talkers with the explosion, and they may be able to transition into this inner turret. And look at the damage coming through from Macau. The explosive shot's going to explode, and man, turrets last no time at all. The Rylai's Crystal Scepter, you just go into a very good poke item in the Lunum Deco, and you're pretty much done with your build. Yeah, actually, Super Mega Death Rocket, I believe, missed was, everything. Yeah, does work, theoretically as Kira's actually going to find Revolta here in the mid lane, gets Explosive Cast back here as well. It's the Rek'Sai finally going to fall down. Yang gets ignored, thank goodness, as he's so tanky. Hard random, they do pick up the jungler. Smurf might be in trouble, as Jockster actually going to flash <laughs> and monsoon him over the wall. Yeah, Flash is in, saves him. Smurf was like, thank God I didn't have to use my Flash. Now it's the standoff, hard random. They have got the dragon aggro. The problem with hard random AOE. is they really don't have that much engage as it's gone down. Yeah, Zap tried to come through, but Macau's actually going to lock that one down. Third Dragon here for Ince is hard random, unable to really get any engages off. So there's really no chance for them to fight here, although they do try and make one. Yeah, Kira looking for it. Symphony actually flashes in. Nice explosive cast gets two members. Jockstar very, very low. Super Mega Death Rocket nets himself a kill. And hard random, they've got Revolta sort of caught with the increased cooldown coming through. Oh, and you can see wow. exactly what happens when they try and siege up. Yeah, True Shot Barrage does do a fair bit of damage here as Dark Binding once again. Not going to find a target. Explosive Shot does knock the Maokai out of there, stopping a lot of the engaged knock up. Not going to come through onto Smurf with that Dark, with the Black Shield, sorry. As it is going to get broken. And look at the burst damage from Talkers. Super Mega Death Rocket though again onto Jockstar. Takes out the support, hard random. Now with a 5v4 situation. The Baron Trap once again. Macau taking a lot of damage here. Righteous Glory pops. Oh, there's the W in from Yang and Kira. He's been picked and now he's dead. Yeah, so they're able to get a kill off it at least. Smurf, extremely low, doesn't have the teleport either. They've started it up another time. This time oh it will goodness. probably go to Int because there's no uh, mid laner coming through for hard random. Although, don't, don't quote me on that. Yeah, Super Mega Death Rocket is available here as well as Symphony. They're looking for something explosive. Cast going to do some work here as Tokas completely unharassed in the back is able to take down Smurf Symphony. Very low wild growth from Demonko comes through, but our Ince lineup just wrecking this team fight. Lex the only one alive. Kira about to respawn as now Cogmore just trying to zone away the AD carry and Ince. They'll get the Baron and maybe a little bit more. Yeah, it certainly looks to be the case. And already they had a great siege composition. True Trap Barrage on its way. Will it find it? No, not even close. They actually stopped damage there, I think, as it came over reward. Wow, Kira. Sneaky what maneuver. And Symphony, they might be able to take this one out. They do. It's actually going to be the rocket over the back of the wall. Five. The Zonya is going to be. Oh, wow. my goodness. This is why you like Luden's Echo spawn, because it is doing disgusting amounts of damage. The inhibitor is going to follow as well here as Dark Binding again going to pick the gap through this team. True Shot Barrage going to do the same in Ints. They take the inhib and they'll be able to back away. It's been working so beautifully and despite having an awful start, you can see, look at that, um, that living artillery. Lex, wow. he has to get out. 
Oh, and Kira as well. He's on Ezreal, that one of the slipperiest champions in the game. And Tokka's still able to land these ones. This AP Cogmore is looking so frightening and so frustrating. Looking to seize that one out. Last turret, of course, apart from the Nexus turret. And oh, there's the flash from Symphony. Doesn't find the knock-up on the Body Slammers. Symphony just getting torn apart. Macau, so much damage, gets the last hit in there as well. And the jungler falls down. The desperation play from Hard Random, not going to net them anything, is now the final inhibitor. Look at Yang goes for a ride there into the back line. Macau as well, jumping headlong into this fight. Tokas getting so much consistent damage as this Tristana ripping apart the Ezreal. The last auto attack on the fountain is going to net them the game because these Nexus turrets, they cannot handle all of these auto attacks to come through from the Tristana. And game one going out to our Brazilian lineup. Yeah, they do it in 38 minutes and in pretty convincing fashion. So hard random need to go back to the drawing yeah. board. They were completely outclassed from champ select to the end.